get ready to give your windows 11 a fresh look in this video we will preview a gradient theme a clean colorful modern style for your desktop you will see smooth transition color soft blends and refreshed visual design that makes your pc stands out this customization is safe easy to apply and completely reversible stick around to learn a step by step process to install this amazing theme without harming your system let's dive in Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll show you how to install a gradient custom theme on Windows 11 safely and step by step. Before we start, make sure create a system tester point. This is always good practice before making any system customization. First, download this required tools. Links are given in the description below. Then we can start the customization. First of all, we have to create a restore point. Just click on search and search for create a restore point and then select your C drive and then click on create and type a name and then click on create then we need to unzip this theme tool so right click on it click on winrar and click on extract files then click on ok and cut this folder into C drive and now open this folder and here you can see the theme tool just right click on it and click on run as administrator and then you need to check these boxes like this one and this one then uh, you just need to check these boxes and click on install uh, after system reboot uh, you need to apply a theme okay so now we need to apply the custom theme unzip this theme folder go to this theme folders and go to windows theme folder then copy this gradient theme just copy it go to c drive go to windows folder and search for resources here you can see the resources folder then go to resources then theme folder and paste it here and now we need to apply the theme just go to c drive go to securex theme file go and run this theme tool run as administrator okay in here we need to select the theme here you can see the gradient theme just select the theme and then click on and apply okay so theme has been applied so here you can see my UI has been my system UI has been changed now so now, now we need to install the icon pack to install this icon pack just uh, unzip this 70sp file Open 70SP folder, then you need to rename it EE to EXE and then click on yes and then run it as administrator. And uh, here you can select the icon pack, click on add a custom pack, and then go to Windows 11 Gradient Theme folder, Windows 11 Gradient Theme 70SP icon and here you can see the two icons just uh, select whatever you want uh, i'd like to select this one and then click on start and then click on yes it will take some time to complete the process then it will record a system reboot just click on yes to reboot your system Okay, as you can see, the icon pack has been applied. Here you can see the new icons, new folders, everything. And now we need to customize our explorer to make more minimalist. Then you need to install a software called Windock. So it's pretty easy to install. Just go download it and install it. So I already installed it. So after complete the installation of Windock, you need to open it and search for a mods. Then click on Explorer and here you need to search for a mod called windows explorer here you can see the windows 11 explorer styler just click on details then click on install and then click on accept risk and install and then go to this theme folder and copy these mods
and then go to advanced tab and paste the code here and then click on save okay so if you want to add some acrylic effect on it you need to install this software called blarmica so right click on it click on winrar and then click on extract files and then click on okay and then copy these files i mean folder then paste it into c drive and now go to release folder and then click on uh, config and here you can see the show lines to make it false and then go to files and go to save and to register acrylic effect right click on it click on run as administrator then click on yes then it will add acrylic effects okay now to add some tint effect you need to change the release file code go to release folder then go to config and here you need to change the code Twenty-eight, nine, and add here forty-eight, and then click on file and click on save. Okay, so you can see the tint effect has been applied. 